Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Kiroshen Alexei, and in this quick news report, I'm going to tell about Lycan and how it can help with the problems of civil engineering. To fully understand the symbiotic relationship between nature and civilization, I will have to ask a professional first. Sir, could you tell me some problems of civil engineering and how to solve them? Yeah, sure. Uh, there are several problems uh, in civil engineering, uh, but the most prominent are definitely the designing and constructing structures for future transport needs and rebuilding uh, existing infrastructure. Uh, these two challenges include uh, designing truly sturdy constructions that would last for many years and wouldn't corrode. Uh, nowadays, uh, composite materials are widely used to partly deal with aforementioned uh, challenges However, sometimes even that is not enough. Thank you. And now let's move to the actual most recent solution. All construction materials are taken from nature. Many inventors combine modern technology and natural resources, and some even borrow ideas from nature for their own creations, which is called biomimetics. More on that from our professional biologist. Thank you. So, this solution from nature can actually be lichen. Lichen tends to grow to ecologically clean places, so it can be used as a potential indicator for ecologically harmful places, materials, or even the whole structures. Of course, lichen already grows on some buildings, but unfortunately destroys most of the materials for it. And so, using this information and using the lichen property to destroy non-organic materials, Engineers can really aim at creating more better materials that are more suitable for symbiosis with nature. Future is looking pretty bright for civil engineering. If the combination of nature and modern technology succeeds, it will be a great help to fix ecological problems nowadays. This has been Alexei Kravashain, and I will see you in the next episode.